and then like the removal process isn't really super hard so i think it's gonna be a good time a few moments later oh oh <laughs> bro i can't do it i can't do it It's Brittany Bianca. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited. This is the first video that I'm filming this year. Today we're gonna try out this waxing kit. Shout out to mom and dad. They got me this for Christmas. But yeah, this kit is from Amazon. Of course, I will have the link down below for y'all. But I think it was about like $30, some $28, $30 something like that but it wasn't really super expensive all right so now that i have everything out let's go ahead and just like get into it all right y'all so our wax is just about melted you want to melt it until it gets to like a honey consistency so now what we're gonna do is prep our skin so i'm gonna use some baby powder you can use either this or alcohol but the purpose of this step is just to make sure that your skin is as dry as possible i got this tip from casey Elias, so shout out to her hey girl yeah i'm just gonna put a little bit like in my hand and then put that on my skin so i'm just gonna put the powder right there make sure you're wearing a shirt that you don't care about so now i'm gonna take a little bit and test it on my wrist to make sure like it's not too warm just like that and it feels fine to me so what you want to do is you want to apply the wax in the direction that your hair grows and then pull it in the opposite direction because i'm doing my underarm i'm gonna do the bottom first okay all right let me um zoom in a little bit so y'all can see okay so we're gonna wait a few seconds for it to dry and then you should be able to remove it <sighs> oh god <laughs> oh oh it hurts oh god <laughs> i am afraid <laughs> okay one two three <laughs> oh god oh bro it hurts it hurts <laughs> bro i can't oh i feel like i'm ripping my skin off oh wow that was painful i don't know if it's like my hair was too long and that's the reason why it hurts so bad but that hurt i'm just gonna take off like the excess pieces of wax as far as like right after you wax just apply like a soothing product over it so i'm using my baby oil with aloe vera and vitamin e just so we can soothe our skin she has been through a lot you can use that you can use like actual aloe vera gel that's really good just something that's gonna like smooth your skin and not be like heavy and clog your pores all right y'all so i had to come back on camera just for some clarity because i realized that i made some mistakes so i tried the wax on different areas of my body i tried it on like my stomach and on my thigh where my hair is like a little bit thinner and it hurt significantly less than it did trying to do it under my arm um, where the hair was like super super thick the wax is definitely gonna hurt more if you have like more hair in an area or if it's like really thick or on the longer side but the more you wax the thinner it grows back every time also when you're a novice waxer like myself and you don't really know the technique do small sections i don't know what the heck i was thinking before but i should have done way smaller sections than what i did i actually did a little bit on this arm like on the very bottom and it went a little bit better than before i did like a small section and it still hurt but um because it was a smaller you know piece it wasn't you know crazy pain so i think i'm gonna go through and do the rest of it we'll have smooth pits on both sides i forgot to mention because this is very important definitely definitely make sure that you exfoliate 24 hours or more before you wax this can help you prevent ingrown hairs like once the waxing is done and it just kind of gives you like a like a clean slate to wax on and then make sure that you don't use any like heavy lotions or exfoliate for i'd say like three days after waxing the areas that you still see that didn't get removed is just because like i didn't apply it the right way but the part that removed like feels really good and that is the problem like it hurt so bad 
but I'm I'm really liking the results. I mean, it's a good kit, you know, it has all the basics that you need. As long as you do like the proper pre-care and post-care, good to go. Well, even though that didn't go exactly as planned, I hope you enjoyed the video nonetheless. I hope you found enjoyment in my suffering. Like I said, this was the Regalico waxing kit from Amazon. If you're into waxing already and you're like used to the feeling and you want to try it at home for yourself, definitely get this kit. But yeah, that's all. I'm gonna just turn the camera off, you know, ice my armpit. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button down below and the notification bell so you know when my new videos come out. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.